Hey guys, bringing you another do-it-yourself computer repair video today. I have an HP laptop here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to run HP's self-diagnostic scan. Uh, sometimes your computer is giving you error codes or it's beeping or you can't boot up or for whatever reason your computer is not running right and you wanna just run this scan to find out what's wrong with your computer. This is a great way that HP has given us to do this. It's one of the nice things about their computers. Uh, so assuming that you cannot start your computer up, uh, I'm going to show you how to get into this from startup. And those of you who can start your computer up, uh, this is still a, a good way to access it. So I'm going to go ahead and shut my computer down here. Uh, if you have any questions throughout this process, if you see anything that you're not recognizing or, or that's throwing you, check out the frequently asked questions below in the description. Um, if you don't see your question there, leave me a comment. I do try to get back to you a couple times a day at least. Uh, to help you through with whatever uh, computer issue you're dealing with. So my computer shut off. I'm, I'm going to start it back up. I'm going to hit power. I'm going to start tapping on F2 right away. Power, F2. Okay, so this takes us to this screen. I'll zoom in so you can see what's going on here. So this is the screen that we want. Yours may look a little different. Uh, but up top, it says HP Hardware Diagnostics. That's what we're going to try to run. As you can see, you have your memory tests you can run, your hard drive checks. That's what we're going to do. So I'm going to scroll down to my hard drive check first. That's kind of the most common scan you can run. You have an option between quick check and extensive check. Um, I will always run the quick check first. It, it'll generally let you know a little faster if, if something's wrong. Um, if it comes back negative and you're convinced something's wrong with your computer or you're still seeing the symptoms, feel free to run the extensive check. Uh, but always start by trying to save yourself some time with the quick check. Go ahead and hit enter. Starting hard drive check. So this will run through. It says right here, smart check. It's already passed it. Short DST. If, if this check fails, if you fail the short DST or if you get another error message failing and your hard drive is bad, Try reseeding it first. What that means is unplug your hard drive, plug it back in, make sure that the connection is secure, try running the scan again. Uh, same thing that goes if you're running your, your RAM check um, or, or your memory check. If it comes back as failed, try taking out your RAM sticks, putting them back in, making sure they're secure because these things do come loose. Uh, these hardware components do come loose. So this is how you would access your diagnostic software. This is how you would run it. Um, if you, again, any questions, leave them below. I get back to you a couple times a day. Like and share if this was helpful. And if you enjoy do-it-yourself computer work, uh, please subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching.